Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm sharing with you a recipe to make perfect guacamole. Guacamole is a Mexican dip made from avocados. It's simple but delicious so if you would like to learn how to make it then let's get started. For this recipe I'm using two avocados. You want to make sure you're using good quality ripe avocados before making this. You don't want them to be hard or else they just won't mash and will have quite a bitter taste to them but you also don't want them to be too ripe that they've browned. Just place pressure on the outside of the avocado and if it gives a little it's ripe, if not leave it for a couple of days to ripen. Cut the avocados in half and remove the stone by striking it with the knife and turning. Be careful not to cut yourself here or a spoon works also. Scoop all of the flesh from the avocados with a spoon and place into a mixing bowl. If you would like the recipe for this guacamole, it will be listed in the information box as well as on my website. To the avocados, we're going to add some lime juice. I prefer lime in this recipe, but if you have lemon on hand, it works also. The lime helps to balance out the richness of the avocados by adding some acidity to cut through it. A tip before juicing any type of citrus, roll it on a chopping board first, that way you get a whole lot more juice out. Slice the lime in half and squeeze the juice out into the bowl with the avocados. Add a pinch of both salt and pepper to season. Don't be shy on the salt, avocados need quite a lot, but you can always add more later on. Start to mash the avocados. I find a potato masher works easier, but you can also use a fork. Depending on how smooth or chunky you like your guacamole depends on how much you should mash it. I prefer mine quite smooth and creamy, so I'm mashing it quite a bit. You can also add diced avocado to the guacamole with the remaining ingredients. For a basic guacamole that still tastes great, you can leave it like this, but there are many other ingredients you can add to it. Most popular is onions, tomatoes, jalapenos, coriander or cilantro, but you can also add mango, pineapple, garlic and many other ingredients. For this recipe I'm using red onions, tomato and coriander or cilantro. Cut the ends off the onion and cut it in half. We only need to use about a quarter of it. Onion can be quite bitter so make sure to dice it quite finely. I'm using red onion because it usually works better raw than brown onions do. It has a milder flavour and also adds some colour to the guacamole. Add the diced onion to the mashed avocados. Cut a ripe tomato in half and use a knife or your hands to remove the seeds so only the flesh of the tomato is left. By removing the seeds most of the liquid is removed, that way the guacamole isn't watered down. Dice the tomatoes up and add them to the bowl. Even if you're not a fan of the flavour, coriander or cilantro is pretty key in guacamole. Run a sharp knife through it and slice it up quite fine. Add it to the bowl with the rest of the ingredients. Use a spoon to mix everything together. If you did want a chunkier guacamole, now is also a good time to add the diced avocado. Once everything is evenly combined, spoon the guacamole into a bowl and serve with tortilla chips. Guacamole is great with many Mexican dishes or it simply goes great on toast. Make sure to give this guacamole a try and let me know what you think. The recipe will be listed in the information box as well as on my website. For other recipes take a look at this chocolate lava cake or this roasted pumpkin soup. For many other recipes, make sure to take a look at my channel and subscribe for a new video each week. Thank you for watching, I hope you enjoyed this recipe and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!